Oh. Hello. And welcome back to part two of Let's Play Digimon World DS with me, Dan.W. On the last episode, we made our start. On this episode, I actually can't remember where we were supposed to go. I think we were supposed to go to the farm now. Um, let's just see if I remember. The right circle is the farm gate. Yes, we're going to the farm. When you get on it, you can go to your Digifarm whenever you want. Understand? Let's go and have a peeky then, because I think we were... Poyomon? Dan.W, welcome back. Let's get started. Dan.W, do you know how you, to use your Digifarm? Let's say not really. I see. Then Kalamon will teach you all about it. Okay, Digifarm basics. Oh, this is very basics. Uh... Okay, so let's let's uh let's just guess as we go along the way. If you want to ask about the farm, ask Agumon at Tamer Union. He should have all the answers. Since you have scan data for Poyomon, let's digiconvert it to have Poyomon as one of your Digimon. You can digiconvert only in a farm. Oh, and digiconverted Digimon are located in your Digibank. Switch them with the Digimon list to raise sorry, switch them with the Digimon list in your farm to raise as many excellent Digimon as you can. Okay, I'll do my best. It's Zulongmon, the Observer, again. Have you learned about the Digifarm? Yes, I think so. You can only be a first-rate tamer if you master the use of a Digifarm. Don't forget. Yes, understood. Anyway, I know this is sudden, but I have a favour to ask you. Yes, what is it? Gabumon, one of the Union staff, has gone to Data Forest and hasn't returned yet. Something might have happened to him. I want you to go to Data Forest to look for him. Gabumon, right? Understood. I'm counting on you. Oh, and also, don't forget to name your Digifarm. <laughs> we will call it Iota Farm. the Digifarm. Let's just quickly look now. Uh, oh, he's got the... I need to do the bank. Can I do the bank here? Let's see. Digimon this. Yeah, I need, I need to go back to the farm then. Location, put in party. Okay, cool. Yes, let's exit the farm and then let's go and look at uh, the digital forest for Gabumon. The data forest, not the digital forest, sorry. Digimon encountered. Interesting. I'm coming from um, coming from uh, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. 
playing this and it's so very much slower. Both leveled up, nice. Type XP, so you get more XP for um, certain types or? <laughs> Fair enough. Cat has decided to rub himself on the, uh, <laughs> the microphone. Let's see, so Koromon. One, two, oh, three on spirit, nice. Three on speed. Yes, yeah, so there's aptitude like um, ability in the Cyber Sleuth series. Well, the Cyber Sleuth game, sorry. So you have to, uh, you have to um, digivolve and de-digivolve to raise it. Nice, that 11 on MP and HP. No. It's 11 on HP, 8 on uh, MP, what am I talking about? Napoleon on 2, 2, 4 on Spirit, nice. 2 on Speed. Nice, nice, nice. 13 on HP, brilliant. Uh, yeah, so you can't walk on the actual grass then. Poyoman, that should be easy enough. See, so we're getting Athen type type XP. But does it matter? Because aren't they both getting It must matter at some point. Does it matter? What's this? Oh, defense plus five is because of his ability, isn't it? Um, so we've got three dragon, two beast, and six aquan. Twenty resistance to war-based skills, and then we've got spirit of one. Very slightly increases the spirit of all allies. Sorry, of allies in the next zone. Hmm. hmm. I think these are the kind of things that we will learn as we go. We couldn't go anywhere this way, could we? No. So we are going straight into the next zone. Yeah, my wonder is, does the does the type of experience matter at all? Does it do you raise your Digimon a certain way if you use more Dragon experience versus more Aquan experience? Or I'm not sure if it actually matters. If it's just a nice way of telling you exactly where you got your experience from. Of 
Solar Mon, there we go. Let's get some sort of dragon experience. Is it dragon type or drake type, I wonder? I've never actually looked at Coromon to see. reach the other ones because you can't interact with them. Next battle should be a level up. He's hoping while looking for government we can get um, at least a hundred uh, scan data for one of them. Um, whether it be Poyamon or Koromon, we can try and um, well, I say try. We can do another Digiconvert and have another Digimon with us. At the very least, then we can Digivolve one of them into something else. Let's see. Then both leveled up, lovely. So what have we got? We've got uh, nine on HP. 11 on MP, 2 attack, 2 defense, 2 spirit, 3 speed, nice. Learned frothy spit, lovely. And so did Poyoman learn frothy spit. Um, what is he got? 12 on HP, 10 MP, 3 attack, 1 defense, 2 spirit, 2 speed. Cool. Hey, there's Gavimon, so we didn't have time to do much. Okay, my bad. So, it looks like I'm wrong, so we won't get to uh, scan enough data, unless I actually uh, run around a little bit before talking. Um, let's see, that's water, so let's see, can I take it down? Spit powerful acid foam at an enemy. Will we take that one hit? No. Like I'm better off at the moment just using charge. Unless this is like the Cyber Sleuth game, so leveling up fills up your HP and MP. Uh, no, let's talk to Gamon and move the story and we can get data later. Oh, what do I do? What should I do? Aren't you Gabamon of the Union staff? Yes, that's right. What's the matter? I came to look for you since you took so long. I'm the Union's equipment staff. Equipment staff? I'm in charge of weapons, armor, and accessories that Digimon equip. I recently got some new items in stock. Two stock, rather. But I dropped one while transporting it. A weapon called Novice Blade. I was taking it back to Central. What should I do if it's not here? It must be back at that place. Okay, then let's go back to check. But Ogremon are known to appear in that area, so it's very dangerous. Oh, I got it. Huh? What's that? Why don't you go get it for me? What? Me? Sheesh. Oh, all right. Thank you. You're a lifesaver. Yeah, this lovely rookie will let two in training go and uh, do his job for him. Fun. This is a shortcut. I appreciate it. Okay, then. I'll be going. Off we go, then. Ooh, the chest there. Pokemon, so yeah, we might be able to still get um, some nice, uh, some nice scan data for these. Revive S. Cool. What's that pad? Nearly 
it's looking like it's going to be Poyaman that I'm going to have to stand there for. Oh, <laughs> there we go. This is my first battle with more than one, um, more than one enemy. Two hit anyway, so Huh, Poemon is a fair bit quicker than Agamon. I need to compare their stats actually then. There's nowhere I can take on an Ogamon. The novice blade Gabamon dropped. This must be it. Grr, what are you doing here? Oh, I'm sorry. I was here looking for something. Is what you're holding it? If you found it here, it's mine. Huh? Why? This is Gabamon's. Shut up. Anything in my territory all belongs to me. If you say no, I'll take it with force. Oh no, do we have to fight? I can't take that Pokemon. Right, let's try something at least then. Uh, to be fair, we may be able to. Probably could have done with already having a third uh, Digimon, but. There's only one more frothy spit. Who's going to take someone out with this? Oh. Well, they've made that very simple and easy. Never mind, then. I was worrying for nothing. First leveled up. Lovely. What do we got? 12 HP for Coromon. 10 MP. And two attack, three defense, three spirit, two speed, but speed 44, so let's see if we can use. No, she's not faster. Boyman's not faster than other one. 10 HP, 12 MP. Yeah, it does heal them to, uh, to level up then. Uh, two attack, two defense, two spirit, and two speed. Awesome. Ugh, how embarrassing to lose against someone of such low level. <laughs> That's what I thought. That's why I didn't think I had a chance. Two in trainings against a uh, champion was not um, an expected win for me. Phew. I'm glad I managed to win. I've got to hurry back to Gabamon. Oh, cool. Let's see what Charge does. Charges. Frothy spear. Oh, a crit. Never mind. That's cool. Remember to charge, take that down. Oh, 
Part of me doesn't really want to go back to Davamon yet. Part of me wants to um, do a little bit of grinding here, but I think I should do that off camera at some point, really. My Digivice is flashing. What could it be? Hey, Dandotw. How's everything? I'll send over a farm report. A farm report? I never told you about this. I'll be sending a daily report of events that happened at your Digifarm to your Digivice. You'll be able to see how much your Digimon is growing and how much food there is for them. Really? Thanks. So I'll be able to view the status of my Digifarm? Yes, but if you're too busy to view it, it's not mandatory. Got it. Thanks, Kalamon. Don't mention it. Would you like to view today's report? No, there's nothing in the farm at the moment, sir. Yes, I think I'm going to come back and, and get data and uh, things off camera rather than doing it whilst on. Oh, a nice Botamon. Yeah, that should be a two hit if Pokemon could do the same kind of damage. Here you go, I found it. Wow, thank you. Now I can go back to Central. Hey, as a token of my gratitude, I'll give you this novice blade. Really? My job is to give equipment items to tamers. I'm supposed to charge you bits, but this time it's free of charge. Wow, thank you, you're so generous. You got a novice blade. Well, I'm going back to Central. Whenever you want new equipment, you should come to me. Okay, I will. We should get back to the Digifarm. But first... Uh, let's see... Coromon... Quick. Attack plus three. Head back to the digital farm then. Oops. Oh yeah. down. Yes, they, at some point there should be, at some point, depending on how much experience I could get in, they should really split for a little bit because Coromon needs two less experience, which isn't a huge gap, but it should at some point make them different levels. Not that it really matters. At some point I'm going to be de evolving and de evolving and they'll be completely different levels at some point, so... Stay here until they're both level once more. There's only a few more fights. Yeah, so as I said before, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna do scan data grinding and probably level grinding off camera in the future. But for now, I just want to get the 
them both to level 7 before. Just because they're so close to level 7, not for it. I'm, I'm not actually... Stop talking. They might be able to evolve, digivolve at uh, level 7, but... I don't really want to leave them with such little uh, experience needed to level up and go back and potentially do more story bits. So. Hopefully at some point soon, maybe even the next level I can start one-shotting these, but not yet. Like two more fights and call them on a bit of a seven. See, it's happened already, the one that I wanted to happen, or said could happen. I think I remember now. Doesn't the type of experience you get uh, affect what you can digivolve into? Like to digivolve into certain Digimon you need, say, a hundred um, dragon data. Or dragon experience, rather. That could be a thing. Nine HP. Just seven MP. That's crap. Two attack. One defense. Two spirit. Two speed. Done. Got one more fight for Poyomon then. And it is a Poyomon. Lovely. Leveled up. Let's see if we can now one shot. Yeah, lovely. That's good. Right. Four, oh, 14 HP. That's quite a lot. Uh, 10 MP, 2 attack, 1 defense, 3 spirit, and 2 speed. Cool. Right, let's go back to the farm. Dan.W, welcome back. Hi, I'm back. I'd better get to raising my Digimon. Oh, it's a call from a Zulong Mom. Well done searching for Gabamon. Yes, thank you very much. I think it's about time you go for the next rank, Bronze Tamer. No, for the next rank, Bronze Tamer. Um, what do I need to do? To become a Bronze Tamer, the Digimon have to accept you as a Noble Tamer. A Noble Tamer? Yes, but this is all I can tell you. Just think and act on your own. I'm sure you could do it. I trust you. A noble tamer. What do I have to do? Stand out W. Is something bothering you? How can I become a noble tamer? Let me tell you something important. Huh? Do you know of a good way? Some Digimon that you're raising now will have a favour to ask you. So ask them what they want. And try to fulfil what they ask of you. Okay, I understand. While we're on the subject, I've actually been looking for a tasty digicake on my way here. It just so happens that I found out there might be a digicake at the training peak. You want me to get that digicake? Yes, I would appreciate it. 
I just sent the address of the training peak to your Digivice. Okay, I got it. I'm there. Actually, I wasn't done. Thank you. Back to Oyota Farm. Okay. So, before we end the episode, we're going to Digiconvert another Puyomon. Another Coromon, rather. <laughs> there will be no nicknaming here. Right, and then... Digimon list, I think. No. Right, we'll move these to the uh, in party. In party. Right. Talk to Digimon, maybe. No. Uh. Evolve into Agumon now. I need, yeah, there we go. So we need 30 plus machine experience to go Toy Agumon. And you need to, I don't care about Dot Agumon anyway. So yeah, let's evolve into Agumon. How can we not do it? Oh, Digivolution menu, there we go. Digivolve. Yes. Red Glove Agumon. Gained a new trait. Which is? Are you going to tell me? Or am I going to have to look myself? Are you kidding me? Uh, I'm going to have to keep renaming them to actual digital names. That's ridiculous. What do we need then? So. 30 plus friendship is that, FND? Or just 17 for Geogramon? Cool. Uh, so. Let's go to Poyomon. And what does Poyomon need? Just 9 for Gomamon. 15 and 70 plus defense for Crabmon or 22 and a thousand Aquin XP for Kamamon. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I like the idea of Crabmon. I don't really care about Gomamon right now. I like the idea of Crabmon. Kamamon's going to be awkward. Not awkward, but. It's going to take a while to get a thousand Aquan XP. I wonder what you think I'm doing three per battle with a Poyomon. 300 is 100 battles. Hmm. It'll take a while. And what's his defense right now? 35. What's a. Uh do they have a max level in this? Hmm. Is 
the aptitude the same as max level? In which case, when I get to know, I'll have to digivolve and, and de digivolve. But I'm quite interested in getting Crabmon. It's going to take a while to get 70 defense, so I'll have to get a few levels. But, um, but yeah. Uh, let's quickly check Agumon's uh, new ability. New trait, sorry, not ability, but you know, powerful. Plus 5 to Digimon's attack. So, what, does he not have the Novice Blade anymore then? Ah, cool. So I can get even more attack then. What did he need for his uh, next evolution? Level 17 or level 15 and 30. 80, sorry, is that it? 80. I assume that's friendship. Because anything like the Cyber Sleuth games, and you need, obviously, in that game, um, camaraderie, you need the max, not max, but more camaraderie to do the one from the anime. Or at least, adventure. Adventure? <laughs> Adventures. So maybe, um, yeah, I'll have a look at uh, what to, to do with um, Poyomon, uh, and obviously, uh, I might just think about what to do to the new Koromon as well. I guess if I can somehow get machine experience, then I wouldn't mind doing Toy Agumon. I don't really want Dot Agumon. Um, mm, mm -hmm, mm, mm, mm. Yeah, that's something we can look into. So, thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And keep with Digimon every Wednesday. I'll catch you all on the next one. Bye.